<clears throat> hey guys, Beth here. Um, you are going to hear my fan running, just warning in the background if you're wondering what that noise is. It is so hot in Alabama right now. It is like 837 at night and it is burning up. Like, I'm, I'm so hot right now. So, um, this is a video, hold on, did I even say, this is a video, a remake of um, a ticket swap that I did from I Art of Stone. And um, I had videoed it on my phone, and um, I videoed it in full HD, and for some reason, YouTube won't accept it, I guess. I guess they don't have full HD. But uh, I tried to change the settings and to remake it on my movie maker on my computer, but it just would not take. I don't know why. I kept rejecting the video. So I'm just redoing it. This is the only one that I had, um, still had. I sent all the rest of them. I didn't have copies. This one I still have because it had like a little tear. Let's see if I can show you. See there in the corner? It was a little tear and I didn't want to send it. So, um,. What I did with this one, it was just a yellow ticket we had got from like a Bible study type thing where they were playing games, it's a little church function. And so I painted acrylic white and then I went in with watercolors and because of the acrylic, the watercolor really didn't set like it usually, it didn't really, I mean like you can tell like on the bottom right there that's, but it really didn't puddle up and dry like it usually does on watercolor so I just made it a whole bunch of different colors there's blue purple yellow pink just like you know just swatched it on there and this Paris stamp that you like Micah this is a uh, Tim Holtz French connection that's the set that it's from so stamp that on the back it's just a little journaling piece and the reason why my other two don't have this on there is because I can't find the stamp my desk is like a huge mess right now like I've been doing here I'm just gonna like, you're gonna be like oh my god look at that yep doing tons and tons of stuff and I just I'm one of these people that don't pick up after myself <laughs> But this is the second one. They, these were all slightly different though. The roses with the um, butterflies, they're all slightly different. And uh, I don't know if I embossed every one of the roses. I might have, but I know on some of them I did. So I embossed this one. I chalked, let's see if I can get it to show. There you go, you can see I embossed it. I chalked it um, with chalk, you know, pink and moss for the leaves. The um, little vines that are all around it. On this one, I did it slightly different. I embossed like with some white embossing powder. Not like really embossed it, it just has a couple little white flecks, you know, because I've knocked most of it off and then stamped over it, colored it with some chalk inks. They all have binds on them. Some of them have different words like love, friends, um, journey, imagine. Some of them have two butterflies, some of them have one. They have different butterflies from different sets. I believe this is a Studio G butterfly. And I stamped that in um, coffee archival ink and then I chalked over it with like blue and purple and then I believe I glossy at yeah. I glossy accented it which for some reason is just not picking up the stuff well anyway it's glossy accented you can trust oh, there you go you can see it now glossy accented okay and on the back of the other ones they had slightly different journaling stamps but um, most of them had the first one like this one right here on this one, these were all done the same, except I believe I put different words on each one. And this was a prima bird with a crown. And these are like the little prima flowers that came in the pack. And I just uh, watercolored the bird with watercolor blue. Um, it's kind of like an orangey color. I mixed with the yellow to make that like, it's not so bright yellow. And then like a uh, light orange for the beak or the facial part of it. I um, just used some Studio G stickles for um, the crown and then um, just a little piece of bling in the middle of that one because the bling was too big for that because they're two different size flowers. 
And then some of them say dream, some of them say imagine, hope, uh, just different things they say, journey. So I believe I made five a piece of each one. But this is um, basically what I, I'm just like refilming just to tell her like what I might use to make them and stuff. So that's it guys. That's what I'm, you know, like lesson learned. I'll have to figure out how to use my phone for because the video on my phone is like so clear. I love it. I mean like it's an awesome video. So like I could probably like <laughs> film it from that webcam onto my phone. It'd probably be better than this one. But you know, you live and learn. So anyway, thanks Micah. I had lots of fun making these tickets. I've also took your advice and um, challenged myself to make some bookmarks and ATCs and stuff like that. So that's basically my entry to iArtist Stone. And it's Micah. She's um, iArtist Stone on YouTube though. You'll see it in the uh, video response title if you want to go over and check it out. So, um, I hope y'all are having a great night. It's super hot here. I guess it's better than cold. So, alright guys. Good night.